morning, everyone. You can see this this fence right here is done on this side. Um, so it's gonna be loud because everyone's just seeing me for the first time this morning. It is very overcast. Um, there shouldn't be any percentage of rain today. Um, but there is rain coming this week. <laughs> Um, tomorrow and throughout the rest of the week. Um, so my plan for this right here is these chickens only have this box to go into. Um, this is our original box whenever I got my um, Black Jersey Giant Pullets. Um, I had got five to start off with. Um, and he, my husband built this literally the day before I had my baby, Elena. Um, I was in labor. Well, I was in, I was in early stages of labor um having contractions while he was building this cage for these girls um so it's it's not what they need right now um we could change the roof on it and use it for other chicks and things like that so my plan is to take take some boards and run them down past the top of this fence so that there's not a bunch of water dumping onto this fence um, more than they it would already get from rain. I want to close that side off, close the top off. Um, we have a bunch more of these fence panels that are old and we're going to put them here. I want to cut a hole in it around here um, and then have a doorway right here and make them a coop built on Good morning, Tom Tom. Good morning, Royal. Look at Royal with his crown. How cute. It's too early for a happy ants on me. This little leghorn's out. Bad, bad leghorn. Okay, so I moved all of the chicks that were in the cage over there. Um, the, the sick cage. Um, my thought is. We have a security camera, and at night, when it goes into, like, um, night vision, um, it has a red light that comes on, and it attracts so many bugs, you can't even see through it sometimes, you can just see them swarming, um, just mosquitoes, gnats, just a bunch of different types of bugs, um, and... What I'm thinking is the heat lamp that we were using um, for those young chicks, um, I think it was attracting, um, yuck, I think it was attracting so many bugs over there that um, they were just being bombarded by bugs. Um, so, basically, gnats will go into the nasal passages and go all the way up to the brain, um, smothering the chickens, um, and I'm wondering if that's the reason why I had a lot of chicks with swollen eyes, um, that had trouble breathing. So, I don't know. But they're over here, and they look very happy. This one little bitty chick, this is the smallest one. She, it keeps getting out. Here are the Polish. So for a long time, this boy would only sleep in this corner over here. But he's finally figured out this roosting pole, which is just an old hoe that I put on here. So... I did some cleaning yesterday around the yard. I didn't finish it, but I moved this cage over here. It's still for sale. I'm trying to find somebody to buy it. Um, but I cleaned out a lot of stuff. Um, the cage is gone. It's up there with um, Fru Fru now. I try to clean that stuff up. Um, I moved the watering system for those chicks to the guineas because their water um, was leaking. So we did a lot of work on this fence as well last night um we got this done very quickly my husband uh, went to work he got home around like 5 30 and we had it done just after dark so maybe like an hour hour and a half we worked on this 
The goats are getting in their winter coat and they look really fluffy. Hi, girl, you look so cute. Binker's doing well. Hungry as usual, even though he's not really hungry because he's fed. Look how fluffy you are. No? You don't want me to touch you? Okay, so, Lily Rabbit. Lily is due on Thanksgiving. And, I felt babies yesterday when I palpated. I don't always feel babies whenever I palpate. But, I did feel babies in her, and they did, they felt pretty big. So, that's good. Sometimes are you cold? So I put these these two together um, yesterday, and then I forgot about them. So hopefully they did some breeding because um, the other day I put Bango and Alice together, and they did not breed. They refused to. It is really cold outside, which means that they should be breeding. So I'm gonna go get Vanellope, and I'm going to put her with Junebug. Um, here, watch So she has an attitude all the time, so I don't know. Well, he's in a good mood this morning. He's not being lazy like he usually does. Come on, Vanellope. Don't do that to her. Look, he's trying to pull her hair off her face. He did that to, um, that's what he was doing to, let's see. Good morning, Callie. That's what he did to Big Mama. And you can see that her her fur is finally growing back. If she'll stay still there. So her fur is finally growing back. So that's why she was missing fur because he was pulling her fur out through the cage. I don't know why he does that. And I don't like it. So I'm going to leave him to try to do what he's doing. So the reason why we stopped working on the fence last night is because we ran out of nails. It's cold, y'all. I'm going to check in here for eggs, even though I know there probably isn't any. Nope.
so we had a flood in this run yesterday. As you can see, there's no water in the pool, but there's lots of wet ground because the geese pulled the hose out of the pool. And then my daughter forgot. Mr. J is such a jerk. He's trying to give you to the fence. <laughs> He'll follow me all the way down. But anyways, the uh, the pool did not get filled up because the geese pulled it out and then it flooded the whole, half the backyard. So whenever I realized she had just turned it off, my daughter had just turned it off. Checking the old nest for eggs. The ducks have started laying somewhere else now. Sneaky little ducks. So let's go check out Azul. She's over here with the baby scratching. So, Sophia named this leghorn Rose. No, don't eat it. Keep eating it. The chicks are fighting over a worm. It's probably dead. I'm sure it is. <laughs> Where'd it go? They stopped. Because they all got different pieces of it. Did they? Are they done? No, that one still has it. That one over there has it. That one right there. Oh, I see it. It's over there. They're going to catch on to where, who has it. There you go. Look, he's got a piece of it. There's, there's like three or four that has it. Look at her. She's looking for her own worms. That's one of those babies. That's the one I got from uh, Miss Lindsay. <laughs> the one that uh, bred our goats for us. Is that over here in this corner? Oh, yeah. I don't know why they like to stay in front of that corner. I guess it's the sweet spot. I guess. So, Sophia, we need to make the decision. Do we keep um, Cowboy? Or do we sell him? And keep his son over there. Son. That's a, that's a boy. That rooster over there. Hey, how come he doesn't have that thing that cowboy has? Because he has a correct comb. It's supposed to be. It's supposed to be like that. Ooh. Look, these chickens have floofs on their heads. You see that little floof they got on the side of the face? That's the ears. Yeah, but I think they're Americana mix. I don't know why they came from brown eggs. Did she just peck you? Yeah, except they still want to pet him. <laughs> See, both of these are girls. See, that one right there is the one that has the, um, that has the black band on its leg. Oh, mama. You want to mm. know something? That one over there Yeah. was was always with B Baby Blue. Yeah, that's the one with Baby Blue, but it's a boy. Oh. So remember when we thought we thought it was a boy? It really was. Oh. I always thought it was a girl. No, nope. that one's always been a boy. So this one's Biscuit. What's the other one's name? The other one's Bearded, like Beard. Oh, 
Yeah, that one's beer. This one's biscuit. That one's. That's the one with the black band. It needs a name. Mm. Strawberry. No, we already have one named Strawberry. Where is it? Freesha. Oh, yeah. I don't know what the name is. <laughs> but I do know what to name him over there. What are you going to name him? Brief. Brief? Like a briefcake. <laughs> a what? Like a briefcake. You mean a beefcake? Yeah. You want to name him Beefcake? Yeah. Okay. Beefcake. You see how he got those little feathers on the on his tail? He's a boy because he's cut. Wait, you have curled tail. But it's a girl though. How come everybody has curled tails? It's just like when he stand, look when he stands to the side, look how it goes down. See it? Oh. Theirs doesn't do that. Look oh, how pretty right. beard is over there. Look at how all the babies are just coming. Yeah, they like attention. They know we, that we feed them. That's your daddy's rooster right there. Look, that one's a rooster. <laughs> That's why he's roosting. What color is that one? There, his, what, what's, what kind of feet does he have? Is it clean feathered feet? He's got little flutes on the side of his head, oh, too. Oh, the bird's about to go in. Mm. He's like... I know they maybe, not, maybe it's not a rooster. You already said they, those eggs came from big old chickens, but I don't know. Mm. So, a little update on the garden plans. Um, I had started using the hoe to clear out this area of grass. Um, my okra are here. You can see there's still still flowers on them. Um, on all of them. I'm doing really good. But, my plan is to actually... Um, you see where the line is of the shade right here? The rest of it gets uh, sun from around 1130 every day until the sun goes down behind these trees. So literally um, most of the day it has sunshine. Um, and this is kind of in the middle of the yard. So once these plants have died down, I'm going to make garden beds all the long Chris um what I'll plan on doing with the goats is possibly connecting the goat pen to the rabbit um to the chicken coop I don't know where I'm going to get my rabbit cage at yet I really want to build something I was supposed to go and get a rabbit cage um Saturday but a lady that I was going to get them from. Um, she did not answer the phone. And she later told me that she had a family emergency. Um, which I mean she may have. But um, then she. Um, told me. She had asked me to come yesterday on Sunday. But Saturday night. I actually lost signal on my phone. And it didn't come back on until last night. Around 8 o'clock. So. It uh. I just. I don't know if I want to go back over there. Like I, I was already in town Saturday, so I really wanted to just go that way um, while I was out, and it didn't happen. So now I'm debating whether or not to do it. Um, there's gonna be a video coming soon. I'm going to make an incubator out of a refrigerator. I'm very excited about it. So that will be coming soon. Y'all stay tuned for that. So. That's what's going on. Burning some trash. Getting a yard cleaned up. I don't really like having a trash pile in the backyard. It looks dirty. So, I would like to not have to do this. I did call the town um, recently, and they said that they do pick up um, bulk trash um, twice a week, twice a month on the first week and the third week, and we weren't able to get our trash out last week. Um, so next week, a lot of stuff has to go to the street. Um, there's a bathtub, a toilet, 
and um, a surround for a shower um, in the yard that we took down. So it needs to go to the street and um, just continue the process of cleaning up the yard. It is important to sit with your fire. Um, and it doesn't matter what you're burning, but you need to um, always watch it so that it doesn't go, um, you know, spread across the yard and cause fires anywhere else. So I'm in a chair. I'm comfortable. I'm sitting here till it goes down.